Okay, welcome back. Today I'm going to talk about some stuff you can buy for your home for an auxiliary power device. Now, if you ever have a power outage in your neighborhood, sometimes it only lasts a couple, a day or two, you know, or even for a few hours. But there's a lot of other reasons why you'd want one of these gadgets that I'm about to demonstrate. Okay, the gadget I have here is called the Motomaster Eliminator, and it's I think it's made by a company in Canada, and I think Duracell sells a similar product. But this is an illustration of many different kinds of products that are out there. And what this is, you plug it in, and it will charge up the battery inside, almost like a lead-acid battery, I believe. I'm not sure what kind of battery it is. But it's enclosed and completely clean and everything. And it'll produce, through this inverter here, up to 800 watts of peak power. Now, you can keep your camera charged up or your laptop charged up. And as I'm going to illustrate right here, I'll turn it on. And I have a few lights here in my shed. And it doesn't burn much electricity. And this particular model has a nice feature that allows you to see approximately how many watts are being drawn from this device. Now, a lot of people don't realize that you don't need a lot of electricity these days uh, to power some very important devices. For example, I have an example here of a little video camera uh, connected up through a USB onto an inverter, which I also have plugged into here. So now I have one, two, three outlets here, and I have two outlets there, and I have a USB port right here. And right now I'm powering a little bit of lights in my shed here, and this comes with another little light. For example, if you're out and have to change a tire or something, you pull this out, and it has a light there. And it also has a very really fascinating feature, which is jumper cables. You can jump a car, a motorcycle, a small battery, or a boat. This is a really handy device, and you just got to keep these not connected here. Now, one of the features that this particular one has that a lot of them don't, and I had a previous version, is it has this meter here, and it, you can put the charge level, find the charge level, or you can find the usage through a couple of switches here. And you can turn this switch on and off, that's the AC power. And right now I have another inverter plugged in here charging up one of my little cameras. So I'm going to unplug this here and I'm going to turn it around and show you that this also has an AM FM radio in the back so you can play some music and for emergencies it would be a perfect thing to have. And it's, I think it's got a clock and, and everything. So again, a very, very simple device. I think I paid on eBay. This is brand new. It was probably a closeout. They manufactured it for this company. It's brand new. And I got it delivered to my house for about 80 bucks. And I consider that a bargain because this thing here will put me through power outage and my shed is powered by it. I can take it to camping. So there's a lot of good uses for it. Now, another thing you don't realize is that here's a 14 volt battery powered drill. Now, you can use it as a drill. You can use it as a small... A socket wrench and you can use it as a screwdriver. Now something like this can be powered and charged up by something like this. So you imagine an emergency and you have the ability to charge up little tools and saws and things like that and you can keep them powered and you can measure the current. It's good to have an old volt meter like this one. This is a really good quality one. I got it very uh, cheaply on eBay because they're closing out all kinds of merchandise. They sell a pile of them, then they have some leftovers, and then they want to go on with the new model. So you can go on eBay or places like that, and you can find really, really good deals. This is a brand new item, and I got it for a very good price. And it's going to last me a really long time as well. It can also read circuits, so it can do amps, volts, ohms, AC, DC, and so on. Now, again, a device like this can be used to power a flashlight like this one, that's a very powerful flashlight, lasts a long time. You have a much smaller type of lamp that plugs into a cigarette lighter. This is a map lamp for a car, but you can actually plug it in over here and you have a little light in addition to the one that's built in here. So there's a lot of value in this item and like I said, there's a lot of companies that make these things, but you want to shop around from price because, you know, there's a competition out there. And if you look around, you'll find yourself a really good deal. So, again, this is one of the things that I say is one of the best stuff to buy. And if you visit my site, you'll see a lot of other suggestions for all kinds of equipment. And we are the entrepreneurs, the travelers, the people who want to get stuff done. 
you keep coming back here and we'll show you the good stuff to buy so that you can get your stuff done quickly and be on with it. Hi, this is Paul again from SellAndShow.com. What we're doing today is reviewing the Sony Bloggy Touch. And I got inspired to buy this after I had seen um, the digital, the pure digital flip video. And it's a very similar device. It has a USB, a retractable USB to um, connect to your computer. Um, and this one also has an HDMI output for high density digital. Now, the first one that I bought was the other one, and I really liked that one a lot, so I decided to try this one. This one has a really good large screen. That's one of the things that attracted me about it, and I really, really like it. Um, it's a touch screen, so you touch basically the menus right there, and uh, you can scroll back and forth as a digital telephoto. And in some ways it's easier to use and it has a larger screen, screen than the one I'm using to record this video, which is the uh, one by Pure Digital. Now, do I like this? Yes, I like it very, very much. I'm going to give it as a gift to somebody, actually my mother, and it's going to have personal recordings around from family, and it's a gift for her birthday. And it's a great, great device, very easy to use. And not terribly expensive. I purchased mine used on eBay where I buy a lot of stuff for very great value. And basically it has a little tripod thing in the bottom that you can connect to a tripod. Um, it sets on there now and you can record any kind of personal video. Now the software that comes with it actually it works automatically with Windows. You have to install something that's recorded right on the drive I guess of the camera itself. And what you do then is you load it up, and if you need the Mac version, um, I have not been able to get it yet, but apparently there's a device or a software uh, for the Mac version of the software. So you can use this device to share with Facebook or YouTube or whatever. And I did import the videos into iMovie on the, for the Mac system, and it works just fine. So, again, this is the Sony Bloggy Touch. Now... It comes with uh, no external battery or internal battery. The other one, by the uh, digital Pure Digital Flip video, has batteries that you can replace. This one does not. But after a couple hours, it runs out of batteries, and you can plug it into um, your computer or any other device for USB charging. Now, this one also has a little switch over here where this one takes a snapshot, so I can actually take a snapshot of whatever I want. There you go, see? Now with the other one by uh, Pure Digital, you can't really do the snapshot feature, but they're both very, very easy to use. Now as far as preference, I don't know, this one has a large screen and everything, but again, it's a little bit, just a thinner kind of a thing, and I feel like when I travel, I'd go for something a little bit more robust, which is the one by Pro Dig uh, Pure Digital, but again, they're both very, very useful very very useful tool so when you travel and if you're in business and you want to make little recordings of meetings and so on very very handy device that's the Sony Bloggy Touch great thing to buy